The eating challenge honestly felt, that was uh, one of the high moments of my life. <laughs> I was just, I had adrenaline rushing. I really did not taste the food that much. Today's challenge, the duck, it tasted very foul. So this is bathroom trip number five. Thanks Austin, I hope you're happy. And so like we're looking around, I'm like, I don't think anyone really has a strong stomach on our team. And I'm looking at like Sokoto and I'm like, they're stacked, they're fine. Red team's like killing it. And I'm like, oh God. And then out comes the damn black fungus. And I was like, oh, it's like, they look like chips, that's fine. And I take one bite and it tastes like ink. Don't ask me how I know what ink tastes like. It was a tragic accident as a child. But like all those memories came coming back and I was like, oh no. And like the first like maybe four mouthfuls or so, like not that bad, but it was an entire plate and I started freaking out. I'm like, oh my God, like once you're like a third of the way halfway through, like you start wanting to like vomit. And it, w it took us like what, like half an hour to get that down. And it was all of us too. The other three people on my team pussied out. I'm gonna be a hundred percent honest. I love Nicola, I love Nat, Matt, but they pussied out. They did. They literally were like, oh, I don't want to do it. I don't, and after a while, like I wasn't really going to do it because I was trying to keep like vegetarian, but I, I also said I was going to be pescatarian a little bit. I, I thought there was going to be actual meat except for like the chicken tenders. So I was like, fuck it, yeah, I'll do it. But like, I was just like, go for it. And like, it wasn't like I was a thousand years behind. It's not like I wasn't using strategy to eat it. I have no fucking idea how fucking Ethan like crammed it and swallowed it with no fucking water. I was like, there has to be so much saliva in your mouth that you literally just, all of it. Food challenge, I was very disappointed that I didn't get to compete, even though I offered myself to sit out. But I knew that my team members wanted to do it and I had faith in them that they could accomplish it. But seeing it done, I felt like it would have been a ton of fun. And so I really wish I had. But we won because Evan's a boss. I underestimated the shit out of Evan um, at the beginning of the Survivor. He is probably our best team member. And I'm very, very glad to have him on our team because he's been pulling his weight in that song. I thought the fi the fifth course would be the most challenging one. Might be something alive. I was not sure that I, c I can eat a warm, a like a live warm. But at that time, Brandon asked me, oh, Sherry, do you want to switch? But I just tell myself that I don't want anyone to switch with me. Even though it's like something live, I will eat that. But like, fortunately, when I uncover the plate, I see that the balloon, oh, that's the thing I can eat. So, and eat with no pain. That's really good. And also I get like actual clue to the idol. <laughs> so that's something very good. I eat a pretty good meal. The first course is chicken tender and like <laughs> the, the second course is like an egg. So that's nothing doesn't matter.